Hello everyone, this is Rogasm here, and welcome to my let's play of one of the greatest RPGs of all time. This, of course, is Final Fantasy VI. And really, this game doesn't need an introduction, but I already made one! <laughs> yeah, I will link you all to the uh, introduction to this let's play where I basically explain what game I'm playing and all that good stuff so yeah go check that video out because we're gonna jump right into it so let's begin shall we pressing A because usually you press start but you press A long ago the war of the Magi reduced the world to a scorched wasteland and magic simply ceased to exist. A thousand years have passed. Iron, gunpowder, and steam engines have been rediscovered and high technology reigns. So the setting for this game is basically an in industrial times. Woo! But there are some who would enslave the world by reviving the dread destructive force known as MAGIC! Dun dun dun! Oh yeah, by the way, magic is evil in this game. Who'd have knew? Very slow. Can it be that those in power are on the verge of repeating a senseless and deadly mistake? Find out in this episode of Days of Our Lives! I mean, Final Fantasy VI! Okay, we're at a cliff, and, uh, yeah, it's windy, and here comes some characters. Hey, it's Vic Mignogna. There's the town. Well, actually, that's Vic's. He's not Vic Mignogna. Wedge. Hard to believe an Esper's been found intact there, a thousand years after the War of Magi. I'm calling it Magi because I'm so cool. Think it's a still alive? Probably, judging from the urgency of our orders. Ellipsy, ellipses, ellipses. And this woman, this ellipsy sorcerer, why is she here? I heard she fried 50 of our Magitech armored soldiers in under three minutes. Not to worry, the slave crown on her head robs her of all conscience thought. She'll follow orders. She'll follow orders. That's a good thing. We gotta keep our women in line. We'll approach from the east. Move out! In our Magitech armor! Yeah, we're gonna trudge through the snow. And I'm going to shut up and let you all listen to this awesome music! Because Final Fantasy VI has the best soundtrack on the Super Nintendo. No doubt about it. Just listen to it.
and we have arrived in the industrial town of Narshi. Let's put her on point. No sense taking any risks. Forward! Good idea, Wedge. Let's put the lady up front to die instead of us. Ooh, I like how the town is moving. Basically, the propellers are moving, the wind is blowing, the smoke... You know, it, it sort of shows some realism in this game. That's one of the things that I like about Final Fantasy VI. It has amazing graphics. It does. It, it, it just shows realism. And what I just showed you there was the magic. She knows two spells so far. She knows cure and fire. And yeah. Machine riding self-important. Send Doverman Pincher. Yay. We get to fight a Dover. Wait a second. That's not a Doverman Pincher. That's a wolf. There's a difference. Come on. Come on. That that wasn't even a fight. I could take care of your werewolves. Oh, he didn't want to. He didn't want us. He didn't want a piece of us. Huh. Well, his friends do. His friends want a piece of us. Do you want a piece of us? Do you want a piece of us? We have magic tech armor. Yeah. Yeah, magic tech armor. Um. We can use lots of spells here, which, of course, the Mystery Girl knows more than the other two. How very, very special she is. <laughs> I guess that's why she has more, because she's more stronger than them. She took out like 50 soldiers in under three minutes, so yeah. Nor she's freedom! Send our Doberman Pinchers! I mean, Grey Wolves! Or Lobo! Weird names for these creatures on this game. Let's use the tech missiles. Yeah! Pew! 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 Tech missiles. So yeah, she knows a lot more than the other two. And she has more than the other two. Is it because she's a woman? Come on. Come on, Japan. Come on. Why do you treat your women with dignity? Why can't you just give them the like the, the lowest stuff? Like give them the weakest weapons, give them the lowest stats, you know. Don't make them have credibility. Come on. But yes, this mystery woman is one of the main protagonists. What's her name? I don't know! We'll have to find out later. <laughs> and it, later will probably be in like a few minutes. So yeah. Yay! Let's use the Bio Blast. I haven't tried the Bio Blast at all. Never. I have never used Bio Blast, not even once. Oh, so it takes care of all enemies on the field. Yet. According to my strategy guide here, which I still have my Final Fantasy VI strategy guide, Bioblast will not affect the were rats, nor will it affect the uh, the Welk, which we will face in the next episode. But yeah, we must defend the mines. Yeah, back to my terrible voice acting. Yay! It's mammoths! I thought you guys were extinct! And we're gonna use Heal Force. And we're gonna use Bioblast to get rid of the rest of these enemies. And Heal Force basically, it. it basically heals you. <laughs> There's not really much to explain. Um, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so I guess now we can move on to the mines. And we just leveled up Wedge and Vix. Which in the Japanese version, he is not called Vix, he is actually called Viggs, I believe, or something like that. It's been a long time since I played the Japanese version. But yeah, by the way, I'm going to cure everybody, and you can do that by pressing R and 
use cure. That's basically it. That's how you cure everybody in your party. According to our source, the frozen Esper is in this mine! Oh really? I didn't know that. So yeah, let's go into the mine. Where we will encounter were rats! Yeah. I love you, were rats. That was the summer. I remember the summer of were rats. Yeah, summer of 1997 when I was playing this game on my Super Nintendo. Yeah, that was the summer of were rats. Nasty farming little creatures. Yeah, Bioblast will not work on these guys because they're poison type creatures. And Bioblast is a poison type move, so yeah. So yeah. Let's go over here and save the game. And this looks like a good st stopping point in this Let's Play, everybody. Um, yeah, I'm gonna save. Show you how to save here. You go to save, and you save, and that's it. Uh, and that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this.